How do we even start this, RJ? Uh, how do we start a video? How do we start a video? Well, we start this we'll video see. with me taking a Snapchat and pulling you right here. You could start this video like a Christian Mingle profile or something and be like, hey, I'm Jimmy Oaks. I'm six foot fuck I'm six foot um, fucking four. I like long walks on the beach. Uh Tall like black men. <laughs> this is the intro. We're gonna do this. Alright, alright. Help me out, RJ. Come on. Alright. Help help me with the intro. Say okay, something. I'm gonna start you with the intro. Alright, so I'm at Jimmy Oaks house. If I could get this thing to focus here, which I probably won't be able to, so deal with it. We have a little surprise. And I'm very excited for this. I've been waiting since the day he got this car for him to make this decision. So I'm going to turn the camera over to him and let you tell you all the good news. What's up, guys? Jimmy Oaks. Um, in here, we're going to do an LS1 swap in my 300ZX. <laughs> mm. Mm. So, so uh, this is where the engine used to be. What do you what you used to have in here? <laughs> Two liter turbo. Originally, we had a uh, 3.0 V6 twin turbo, original twin turbo. Cry about it. Um, that blew up at the end of last season where our oil pump went. Sad day, whatever. So time to move on to bigger and better things. America! <coughs> All right, back to the plot. <laughs> so we're doing an LS1. We're gonna do all aluminum LS1. Um, no LSX bull. Um, aluminum block, aluminum heads. Um, came out of a 01 Camaro. Um, Actually, it came out of a 2001 Pontiac Trans Am Formula. Same thing. It's not. Same thing. One's better looking than the other. Same, same, <laughs> but different. <laughs> <laughs> so, first, uh, I just got today. Uh, I haven't even gone through it. Um, so the first thing we need to do is just strip off all the wiring and all the accessories and just everything else we don't need. So. Let's go. Oh wait, I can take this whole thing off? Look at this, just look at this. Look. You okay there, look at RJ? This. Just look at this. Go look at this. You go look, look at this, look at this. Can you see this? You gotta take this bolt out, and it's at like the last quarter of an inch, and it just hits the alternator. <laughs> There's no way to get that part out. Cut it. <laughs> I think I don't need these bolts, right? Because the threads are definitely stripped. <laughs> 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 that happened. It's been a long day. <laughs> <laughs> Making progress. Trying to get post slapped over here. What are you doing, RJ? Taking off the motor mounts, but efficiently this time. Efficiently. E F F E C I N efficiently. <laughs> yep, <Yeah>, seems right. <laughs> <laughs> Take it or leave it. All right. Ow, my butt cheeks. I got both motor mounts off. J. Timothy's wings and a six-pack angry orchard. Yes. Here we go. Right. What do we got? So excited right now. Big Chick bucket. Chicken wings. 
So we just ate, um, and the motor is now basically fully stripped to the point where I want it, um, minus the intake manifold. Um, next, really, I want to pick up paint to paint my valve covers because I forgot, I just kind of want to get it over with, so we are off to Walmart right now. All right, RJ, so I lied. We're at, we're at Home Depot instead. Wait, what did you lie about? I said we were going to Walmart. Oh. Um, oh, it's like walking into a tree. See, I should just do my valve covers like, no, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Perfect. Focus. Focus. There it is. I did Roger, it. do you think this is V8 specific paint? One, two, three, four, five. I'm seeing five on each side, so this is a V10, so this is gonna add horsepower. Jimmy, be like Boker. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so we just got back from Home Depot. Um, Depot. Depot. Uh, I just got my paint for my valve covers. Um, at this point, uh, the motor's pretty bare. Um, let's see it. Um, so all that's really left is I'm gonna pull my valve covers, clean them up, paint them black, and then I'll probably pull the intake manifold and just start cleaning the rest of the motor up, AKA just w rubbing it with a wire brush into the aluminum. Um, so. Sick. And remember, every time you paint something, it adds more horsepower. Fact. <laughs> Over here, we're going like six inches at the most. You ever seen an iPhone 6, baby? That's about how big I get. Time to see how fucking shitty it is underneath there. Cross your fingers because it could be gross. Cross your fingers, hope to die. Kicking puppies makes me cry. Yeah, that would, that would do it. <laughs> A lot cleaner inside than I thought. I'm really pumped actually. I was expecting the worst. So it's a little sludgy from sitting, but like I said, could be a lot worse. So sick. Quit fucking up, RJ. Bruh, I swear to God, I won't do anything. <laughs> I mean, that's, a lot, that's a lot of miles to put on the car. You could do in 20,000 miles. Just think about it, we put. Are you alright? You okay? Fuck being sick. Valve cover off on the right side. Just like before. Looking really good. Super stoked. Cleaning up the motor, starting to look decent. So, awesome. <laughs> Whatever, I'm painting my valve covers with some good old fashioned V8 high temp paint. But wait, there's more. But wait. <laughs> No, there's not, there's not really more. Yeah, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna warm this bottle up. <laughs> yeah. For the baby. For the baby. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. What's the proper technique for painting? Um, get what's in this can and put it on the surface that you want it to be on. That's how to paint. All right, gotta paint 101. Wet, dry. A couple more coats. Should be minty fresh. <laughs> I just wish I had an impact right now. Look at these nice threads. Mm -hmm. God, I need to stop. Doing that. <laughs> Ding! Round, round two. one. <laughs> well, the good news is, is those gaskets are in really good fucking shape. So the engine's pretty bare now. Um, 
Basically a long block with an intake at this point. Parts are everywhere from the motor. Oh, kind of stuck for a lot of work because I'm have to wait till I get my water pump in to do my accessories. Um, so at this point, it's kind of cleaning the motor. I still got to change the crank pulley to my new crank pulley because this one is just rusted the crap. So it's not worth it. So I picked that up today um, and a few other parts at my uh, my favorite part manager. Hey, that's me. <laughs> It's like I fucking hate him. Um, so, <laughs> no really, um, what's left is clean up the motor a little bit more. Got to um, finish painting the valve covers. Um, they're still drying, so I'll probably do um, another coat on those. Throw those back on, throw new plugs in, and then um, my new oil pan in, and we'll go from there. So, I'm tired. RJ's tired. Hell yeah, I am. Um, so I think it's, uh, it's clean up and bedtime. So what's up, guys? Um, I've been sick all weekend, so it's kind of been slow. Next weekend will be a lot more eventful. Really just got the motor torn down just a little bit. Ready to be put back together. Also waiting on a lot of parts for the motor to get that back together. So since I'm all new to this, um, I'd really like to see what you guys have to say. Uh, please, any suggestions, let me know. Anything you want to see, any questions, help me. <laughs> a lot more fun stuff to come, so please like, subscribe, follow me on Instagram, whatever you want to do. So I gotta head back to school, just gonna clean up a few things before I leave, and I will see you guys next weekend.